Lucas, bem-vindos para mais um vídeo aqui no meu canal e esse vídeo tá sendo um vídeo meio que espontâneo porque eu tô aqui na casa da minha chefe, a gente tá gravando um monte de vídeo pro canal do YouTube da empresa e agora ela vai fazer um, uma bebida que a gente vai mostrar no vídeo Olha ela I'm gonna give her a lesson on English Christmas, well it's actually European, Glühwein E ela vai fazer essa bebida, Glühwein e eu vou filmar ela fazendo essa bebida pra vocês saberem como é que faz, pra vocês fazerem aí no Brasil, pra ter um pouquinho, um gostinho de um Natal gringo. Ok, so it's nearly Christmas, so this is what we drink. Typically, um, in England we call it mold wine, and if you go to like evening Christmas fairs and Christmas events, you always get mold wine. And if you go to Europe, so say you went to Austria to visit the Christmas markets, in the middle of the day there'll be stores and huts serving what they call, so same, but it's called Glühwein. It's basically hot red wine, which is sweet, and then it's filled with Christmas spices. So, we have normal red wine in here. Then um, the major ingredient is what we call cloves. So these are the ones that sometimes, you know, they get stuck in oranges. <laughs> um, so I'll have a few cloves in it. I think we call it cravo. I think okay. that's what it is in Portuguese. Ah. Um, the other thing we'll put in it is orange. And quite often we'll actually grate the zest of the orange in as well. Maybe cinnamon, canela, and so do you put it in whole like this? Yeah, <laughs> and maybe some sugar. <laughs> People can do it slightly differently, but that's that's my. They are cloves and red wine is the fundamental, and the kind of orange, the orange as well. So is the orange an English edition? No? Because I, I, I don't know, I'm under the impression that English people love everything orangey, especially because chocolate, chocolate orange. Yeah, we do like chocolate orange. We do like a chocolate orange. Okay, so, so how it's long the middle, it it's to... the middle of the work day. Just, you just want to simmer it and make it hot um, and then like boil it a bit. Yeah. In England, we will tend to then have it as a wine glass, so we'll serve it like a wine. Whereas, um, say like Luke and I went to Austria, to the Austrian markets, they will serve it in like a coffee mug. Mm -hmm. nice. but, yeah, but in the UK you serve yeah. in the wine glass. There you go. More wine. 